Right, today I'm going to show you how to make bunny chow. Bunny chow is a dish that was invented by street children in the depression in Durban in South Africa in the 1930s. It's a hunger buster food and they originally used to hollow out a quarter of a loaf of bread and pour some cheap curry into it. But I'm going to show you how to make it for guests. You're going to need good Indian curry, some sambals, uh, I use tomato, onion and cucumber and a few slices of banana and then you need a really good fruit chutney. Now I don't know Mrs. Balls from a bar of soap and she doesn't pay me any money for this but I can assure you this is the best fruit chutney in the world today and if you can't get this I feel sorry for you. So there we go we, uh, we start by slicing just the top of the bread, the roll off and then I'm going to surgically remove the center of the bread. It's good to use a roll or bread that's got quite a nice crust because it's going to have to contain your curry gravy. And I just use a fork. Keep these bits that come out the middle. They're quite useful to mop up your plate. Um, then you get uh, just a teaspoon, add some of your sambals in first, sambals, a bit of banana, and then your curry warmed up. You can warm up the roll as well in the oven if you like to, and just keep layering it like that. Curry again, fill it right up, press it in a little bit, and then what you do is you put the top on the roll and you put it on the plate so that your unsuspecting guests are not quite sure what you're offering them. And then, like those Ponzi TV chefs, you just decorate your plate a little bit with a bit of greenery. I normally just dribble a bit of olive oil on the plate as well just to make it fancy and then if they want to keep their composure while they're eating they can eat this with a knife and fork but the real way to eat this is to just take the top off bring it up to your mouth mmm fantastic I nearly forgot you have to use the chutney so just put a little bit on the side of the plate and then before each bite just put a little bit on the top of your roll like that mm. that makes all the difference the secret of this is to use a really good curry now if you click on the link below this video you'll get the recipe for the curry that I've got here. It's made by Anne and it's the best curry this side of Calcutta.